Hello guys, it's me Vladimir Putin and today we're gonna be making a, a gazebo, a medieval gazebo. But first, let us put some MC music. Yes, so calming. Now the medieval gazebo we're gonna do today is gonna look something like this. It's pretty nice, pretty epic, pretty beautiful. From the inside, yes, there's lighting. Simple, simple lighting. And let's get started. Okay, so first off, we're gonna start by putting barrels obviously it's just like this and I'm gonna show you right now how to put the barrels I'm gonna leave a three block gap between them and it's gonna be looking something like this after that we're gonna put one block of oak log not like that above every barrel after that we're gonna grab our dark oak wood stairs and we're gonna put them just like so Okay, after that's done, we're gonna grab our full block and you're just gonna start putting the floor. Now it's gonna look something like this, okay? Now what we're gonna do is grab our spruce trap doors and we're gonna put them on the sides. Just like that. After you put the spruce trap doors. We're gonna grab our spruce fence and we're gonna put it on the side of every log. Just like so. After we've done that, we're gonna grab our spruce fence gates and we're gonna put them between the fences. Just like so. Then, we're gonna grab our stone walls. In this case, I'm using a cobblestone wall and an andesite wall. We're gonna put them above every log. Not like that. Something like this. No, something like this. After we've done that, we're gonna grab our spruce fence again and we're gonna put them on top of every wall. Just like so. After that's done, now we're gonna put our walls again on top of every fence. Just like so. After that's done, we're gonna grab our spruce fence gates and we're gonna put them on the sides of every wall. Now after we've done that, we're gonna put a spruce fence gate between the gates. Just like how I'm doing right now. After that's done, we're gonna grab our spruce wood stairs and then we're gonna put it like this. Yeah, pointing within the circle. Something like this. After we've done so, we're gonna put the spruce stairs upside down, just like I'm showing right here. I'm gonna do it again. After we've done that, we're gonna grab our spruce trap doors and we're gonna put them between the upside down stairs, just like this. It's gonna look something like this. Pause if you need to. Then after that, we're gonna put the stairs above the trap doors on every side just like this after that's done we're gonna put the spruce trap doors on the sides of every stair we've put just like this after that we're gonna grab our spruce wood slabs and we're gonna go up by half a block just like this And after we've done that, we're gonna do the same once again. And we're gonna connect it. And now it's gonna look something like this. Now, we're gonna put a trap door on top. Now what you wanna do is grab the oak wood slab. And I'm gonna go up by half a block in front of these stairs on every corner. Just like so. After that, we're gonna put a full block on every slab we've put. Just like this. It's gonna look something like this. Finally, we're gonna put slab on the holes. 
Now for the lighting from the inside, you can put a redstone lamp right in the middle and put a block of redstone on the side. Now you can cover that up by trap doors and putting the trap doors on the sides. Just like so. Putting a spruce wood slab on those spots. And that's it. We're done. Look at that beautiful gazello or gazebo. What do we want to call it? Now, of course, you can do the outer deco by yourself. You can even examine mine if you want to. Please like and subscribe if you want more videos like this. Since, again, these are the videos I literally enjoy the most. And that will be all. Bye. Adios.